Psalm 107 Read from the Message It's time you appreciated God's deep love. Verses 1 to 3 Oh, thank God! He's so good. His love never runs out. All of you, set free by God, tell the world. Tell how he freed you from oppression, then rounded you up from all over the place, from the four winds, from the seven seas. Verses 4 to 9. Some of you wandered for years in the desert, looking but not finding a good place to live, half starved and parched with thirst, staggering and stumbling on the brink of exhaustion. Then, in your desperate condition, you called out to God. He got you out in the nick of time. He put your feet on a wonderful road that took you straight to a good place to live. So thank God for his marvellous love, for his miracle mercy to the children he loves. He poured great draughts of water down parched throats. The starved and hungry got plenty to eat. Verses 10 to 16. Some of you were locked in a dark cell, cruelly confined behind bars for defying God's word, for turning your back on the high God's counsel. A hard sentence, and your heart's so heavy, not a soul in sight to help. Then you called out to God in your desperate condition. He got you out in the nick of time. He led you out of your dark, dark cell, broke open the jail and led you out. So thank God for his marvelous love, for his miracle mercy to the children he loves. He shattered the heavy jailhouse doors. He snapped the prison bars like matchsticks. Verses 17 to 22. Some of you were sick because you'd lived a bad life. Your body's feeling the effects of your sin. You couldn't stand the sight of food. So miserable, you thought you'd be better off dead. Then you called out to God in your desperate condition. He got you out in the nick of time. He spoke the word that healed you, that pulled you back from the brink of death. So thank God for his marvellous love, for his miracle mercy to the children he loves. Offer thanksgiving sacrifices. Tell the world what he's done. Sing it out. Verses 23 to 32. Some of you set sail in big ships. You put to sea to do business in faraway ports. Out at sea, you saw God in action saw his breathtaking ways with the ocean. With a word he called up the wind, an ocean storm, towering waves. You shot high in the sky, then the bottom dropped out. Your hearts were stuck in your throats. You were spun like a top. You reeled like a drunk. You didn't know which end was up. Then you called out to God in your desperate condition. He got you out in the nick of time. He quieted the wind down to a whisper, put a muzzle on all the big waves, and you were so glad when the storm died down, and he led you safely back to harbour. So thank God for his marvellous love for his miracle mercy to the children he loves. Lift high your praises when the people assemble. Shout hallelujah when the elders meet. Verses 33 to 41. God turned rivers into wasteland, spring of water 
into sun-baked mud. Luscious orchards became alkali flats because of the evil of the people who lived there. Then, he changed wasteland into fresh pools of water, arid earth into springs of water, brought in the hungry and settled them there. They moved in. What a great place to live. They sowed the fields, planted vineyards. They reaped a bountiful harvest. He blessed them, and they prospered greatly. The herds of cattle never decreased, but abuse and evil and trouble declined. As he heaped scorn on princes and sent them away, he gave the poor a safe place to live, treated their clans like well-cared-for sheep. Verses 42-43 Good people see this and are glad. Bad people are speechless, stopped in their tracks. If you are really wise, you'll think this over. It's time you appreciated God's deep love.